workouts, and helpful advice. Add this video to your favorites. It will guide you when you train. Next exercise, side crunch with ankle touch. Three, two, one, go. Never lift your lower back off the floor. Keep your abs contracted to avoid mistakes. Do not strain your neck. Try staring at a fixed point on the ceiling. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, side plank plus full side crunch. Three, two, one, go. If you are unable to complete this motion, try doing a regular side plank. Don't bend the neck sideways to avoid forcing it. Be sure not to lean the bust forward. The shoulders should be in line with your hips. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Do not look at the floor. Stare at a fixed point in front of you. Do not lower or lift your pelvis. Head, shoulders, hips, and feet should be aligned as if they were following an imaginary line. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, twist on the ground, plus lateral punch. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try doing a simple twist on the ground. Keep your abs constantly tight to avoid burdening the spine. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, crunch cross, outstretched leg. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try resting your heel on the floor before moving on to the next contraction. Never lift your lower back off the floor. Five, 
five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't use the resting arm to help you. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, complete split crunch. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try the exercise while resting your legs on the floor. Never lift your lower back off the floor. Contracting the abs will help. in the shortest time possible. Go. Do not strain your neck. It helps to stare at a fixed point on the ceiling. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, full side crunch. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try not lifting your leg and concentrate on your bust. Don't bend the neck sideways to avoid forcing it. Go. 
be sure not to lean the bust forward. The shoulders should be in line with your hips. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Three, two, one, go. Next exercise, side hip abduction plus lying leg kicks. Three, two, one, go. Don't keep the supporting leg straight. Bend it to have greater stability. Don't stretch out your foot. Keep it constantly flexed. Don't move your back. Your head, shoulders, and pelvis should always be in line. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't turn your head. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you to help. Don't turn your back. Keep it always perpendicular to the floor. Exercise side hip abduction. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try resting the foot on the ground after turning down the leg. Don't keep the supporting leg straight. Bend it to have greater stability. Don't stretch out your foot. Keep it constantly flexed. Don't move your back. Place your hand in front of your bust for stabilization. Don't turn your head. 
Try staring at a fixed point in front of you to help. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, pulse side hip abduction. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try smoothly raising and lowering the leg, creating a wider movement. Don't keep the supporting leg straight. Bend it to have greater stability. Don't stretch out your foot. Keep it constantly flexed. Don't move your back. Place your hand in front of your bust for stabilization. Don't turn your head. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you to help. Hip abduction on all floors. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Be sure not to rotate the pelvis when you lift the leg to not strain your back. Don't put your knee on the ground when you take down the leg to increase the effectiveness of the exercise. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't bend or curve your back. Keep your torso parallel to the ground. Don't lift your head. Your neck should remain in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point on the floor. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. 
Next exercise, donkey kicks plus hip abduction on all floors. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Be sure not to rotate the pelvis when you lift the leg to not strain your back. Don't put your knee on the ground when you take down the leg. Keep the contraction constant. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't bend or curve your back. Keep your torso parallel to the ground. Don't lift your head. Your neck should remain in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point on the floor. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, donkey kicks crossover. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try the donkey kicks without crossing your legs. Be sure not to curve your back during the movement. Don't put your knee on the ground when you take down the leg in order to keep a constant contraction. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't turn your hips laterally. Your back must always be very straight. Perform the exercise slowly to maximize the effectiveness. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, pulse donkey kicks with leg at 90 degrees. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try smoothly raising and lowering the leg, creating a wider movement.
Be sure not to curve your back during the movement. Keep your foot flexed and your leg at 90 degrees for optimal muscle work. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't turn your hips laterally. Your back must always be very straight. Don't lift your head. Your neck should be in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point on the floor. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Three, two, one, go. Next exercise, stretching buttocks. Go. Bring your arms forward for a better balance. Don't arc your back. Keep your abs constantly tight. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, stretching hamstrings. Go. Don't bend the leg. To achieve the maximum elongation, it must always be well stretched. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, stretching quadriceps. Go. Don't force the push. Stop when you've reached the limit. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise abdominal stretching. Go. Never lift your hips off the ground. This will increase the effectiveness of the extension. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. 